Professional. Who is that? He's so professional. Crazy <laughs> I had to fight off a man. He was up in my living room doing some weird shit, butt naked on the floor. I had to fight him off. It was two against one. Cause his penis was out. Ain't that a oh, bitch? I ain't having it. This is wild times we're living in. You just come on from a hard day to bed. And there's just some man butt naked in, in the living room singing to your wife with his dick out. Action's gonna happen. Hi, how are you? How'd you, how, how'd you feel about um, what went down, you know? You're so professional. Oh. Can I, um, you so know what, you stole my notebook. Yeah, you, I, I think I see it. I over think there. you messed it up. I think you messed it up, because you're so professional. Right. Yeah, you f what else did you forget? What else did you forget? A little, bit of A little bit of dignity. Okay, anyway, folks, we're here today. This evening, rather. We're here. We're here. We made it. We made it. <laughs> I'm Once not, again. I'm not really. What is it, man? A year and a half. Right. I'm not Never bad at missed that. Never an episode. Your boy's turning 38. And, oh, on the 27th. I'm not that upset. But, but I man, could be. We, we've been doing this for almost a year and a half. Right, we've I'm been doing this for far too long. And, yeah. Even, like, I even did episodes did where I was almost dying. But I never, I never get off. Look at your cute, baby. look at your cute smile. So, oh, Aren't you just, I got this. Aren't Woo! you just adorable? Aren't you just a dude? I don't know, man. Man, I, I, dude, I get a rush from the music. I, I, I get, it's, it's I like, it's a drug like I've never known. Just, I love music. Weirdest, weirdest stuff. I don't know what I wrote, but it's there. It's all there. And you I want to start it. us out with what you wrote? Do I? Usually, I would, always I, this start. Is, if you didn't know, we, this is a show we do called oh, Items of Interest, Poems and Propaganda. I would like, um... 
for the first time, let let my dear lady here start it off with something. So if you're just tuning in for the first time, folks, we're a little wild. We're a little batty. But it's okay. It's gonna be fine. You're in good hands. No one's gonna get hurt. Okay. I hope. So let's see. Sam. Um, there was a question I didn't get to last week. Okay. What if... This is a what if, and I like these questions. Okay? <laughs> They're all so annoying. But here we go. What if you had the choice to live in someone else's skin for five hours? You could pick to be whoever you want. Who would you pick? For Jack five Nicholson. hours. Why did I know you were gonna say that? Why I didn't know, I man. know? For some, for some reason, reason I saw Jack him. Nicholson came straight in my I head. saw him in my head. No, Jack Nicholson. I was thinking. I feel like I can I feel like I can relate to Jack For Nicholson. five hours. So what do you no, think you man, might learn? I just feel like when I see Jack Nicholson, right. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I could I, I can see that. What do you think you might learn in five hours being Why here? did you think I would think Jack Nicholson? I don't know why, but I saw him in my head no, but when that's, I was writing that, that. Jack Nicholson. That's funny that you thought the same thing I thought when I wrote the that's question. That's what I saw when you read it. Right. So it's Jack Nicholson and that's what else do you funny. want? That's funny. What do you think you would learn being him for five hours? If you could guess, picture him in your head. To make your own decisions <laughs> and fuck everybody else. Fuck everybody else. Okay, yeah. That sounds about right. Sounds like him. But it does sound you know, like him. That means you're not influenced. So that I, I can I can understand. There she's back again. She's back. Your mom. Hey, back. baby. She's your feline mom. <laughs> Look at her. Licking my paws and thighs. Keep that big orange crooked eyed cat out my ass. You notice she has given him a run for his money. That cat. The oh thing is, God. the biggest cat in town is Orange. And the only reason he's not getting no pussy is because he's got that one crooked he's, eye. And he is no, cross None of the bitches want to fuck him he's because cross. of that one eye. He is. Yeah, but... <laughs> I feel so bad for him, though. You just see him walking around screaming. Tobias is on he's cocaine. He's so fucking... Dude, I feel so bad for him. Tobias is on to cocaine. I got some. You know, he's okay. He's <laughs> okay. Yeah, cat, he's fine. Man. man, he's been trying for years. Yeah, he's, he's in love, but she's like, no. Nah, but, Ring. you know, I said, what a pretty cat. And he looked yeah. at her and I said, no wonder he's getting no pussy. <laughs> See, he looked at me. He was like, do you know he wanders and around? And his eyes are all fucked out up. There. I was like, hell no. And he cries. I know, and I talked he, to him. He's a sweet guy. And I it's said, just, he's got what you crying? I said, what you crying for? Yeah. I got this man. I wrote this down. I think Friday after work, man. I was in pain, and I was, man, my baby and her. And, no, who gives a fuck? Yeah. But I wrote this down <laughs> because I, I had a. You ever sit down and have a flashback of your childhood, and mm -hmm. it starts making you laugh because you never really look back on it until that moment. And you, instead of telling you about it, right. I wrote it down and saved it for the show. You see it in a Here different light, right? Counselor, high risk behavior. What would you do? If you were getting drunk, then the phone rings. You have to drive your dad to the hospital. My reply, well, I'm going to be there in a few minutes. Light the fucking fire, kick the tires, we're entering the danger zone. The danger zone. I'm going to shave my head. If they ask for my ID card, I will say it's back at the house with my aides. I get the house with my aides. We don't give a fuck. Right. Is the attitude we had to say. Sure. Because I'm going to tell you right now, man, I sit across the room, man. I got put into counseling, and they threw me out so fast. Yeah. I, I was so fucking... Why did they... I was so hard when I was young, dude. I sat in this guy right. in a beanie cap and flip-flops. Mm -hmm. No socks, just nasty flip-flops. Talking so like, yeah, man, and this and that in front of the council group. Dude, I went, I went fucking Huey P. Newton on his ass every day until they kicked me out of counseling. Mm -hmm. But I was like, but why do I sit in your office and you try to tell me to be sober? I said, why do you got a bottle of wine on your bookshelf? It's right. Like, it's, like, it's a collection. 
<laughs> what? I said, but I said you setting a bad example. That's true. Yeah. And he said, well, I passed the program. It shouldn't I can have, have a drink in there. if I want to. And I said, well, you're setting a bad example. Because I studied his room and I looked at his books and I said, you, you're still drinking. Though. Right. And I said, um, I didn't give a fuck. Dude. No, you're right. But though. I beat him. You know what? Mm-hmm. I never drank. No. I drank. When I got out of those meetings, I would get drunk for one day and then that's it. Right. Because it didn't matter. I don't need to drink, but what I told him was bullshit. And the reason I got those classes is because the old man said I was shaman and he gave me a free pass. Oh my. Okay. <laughs> I yeah. don't know why. Right. He said, he said you're, you're, <laughs> dude, they let me out. <laughs> right. He said, you're, you're magical. Go on. Yeah. <laughs> Go wild, child. That. He was Go. Like, he's like, he's close me and I'm <laughs> Run. <laughs> Run wild, child. You're glowing. Run. And I was like, I don't know what this hippie bullshit is, but I'm about to cash out on this bitch. Go save yes, I do. Yeah. Save yourself. Bye, bitch. <laughs> save yourself. Yeah. Scary. And all that shit, too. Yeah. Boom. You got something. <laughs> yeah, I do. I have several things here. Yeah, man. I was, yeah, that was a wild ride. Yeah. But that was a true story so, in itself. Okay. But it's very fabricated at the end because I did eat a Dove candy bar that was a little so, weird. do you want to hear? Yeah, I, um, I want to hear anything. Let's see. You are in an alternate reality. This is not the game, although it sounds like it. You are in an alternate reality right now. You are selling jars of some sort of nauseous smelling jelly for public consumption. Yet, it is the most delicious delicacy to hit the streets. How do you get people to buy a food that smells so awful they'd likely throw up as soon as you open one of the jars? Now, there How are would you foods do that? like that. Yes! And... But, you know, I can't understand this question for one reason. Okay. I was born without a sense of smell. (laughs) Okay. So I don't really know what it smells. Right. Well, that makes it even more complicated. That means I'd be eating this shit, and it's like... (laughs) And and I wonder why nobody wants to talk to me, because my breath smells like shit. That's why I eat fish and shit, but you notice how I don't realize how bad it smells when I walk around and eat onions. I got food. Funky breath. I don't give a fuck. I can't smell my body odor. I think I smell great all the time. Actually, to be honest with you, let me tell you this. But I have no idea what I smell like. I just try to measure it. You really do, like, your B.O. smell... It's good. I'm sorry. It smells really good. Even when you're punching, it smells really good. And I'm the man. And maybe that's it. But the thing is... And maybe and, that's just um, and you know that could be like um a biological thing too. Maybe you just smell know. good to me. I don't know what smell. You might just it smell good. To me. Me but the thing is, because I don't understand it. But the thing is, I can hear like a right, motherfucker from fifty yeah. yards away. I can listen to a conversation. Right. I got ears now, like a motherfucker. And well, probably not for long. Um, if I keep beating them. Now, like if you have beer, you're gonna have beer breath. However, <laughs> sometimes if you eat foods with spices to it. Like garlic or something? Yeah. Do you know you have the most sour fucking breath smell? Spice, and it spices, smells so huh? bad. It's the spice. Right, mixed it's, with the beer? Yeah. It just smells so, so bad. So that's what I should avoid. Right. All right. That's a so good note. Yeah. I had to have somebody tell I me because I can't right. smell. Yeah. But if you want to know what they're talking about <laughs> next door, I can tell you because right. I can hear it. But here's the thing. <laughs> so say, say you know. Say you know. <laughs> These jars of jelly smell god awful, but you know yeah. they taste well, delicious. But the thing is, if it's what are you gonna? How are you gonna sell them? How am I gonna sell them? How are you gonna sell that? I'm gonna make. I'm, I'm gonna jack the price up to a thousand dollars a jar, and rich people will think yeah, that's what you do. Okay. Now it's delicious, okay. but it right. smells bad. So you raise the price so so much that only the richest of the rich can okay. afford it. And they'll buy it. They'll buy it. Just so nobody else can have it. Right. And they'll eat it. It's a delicacy. And they'll eat it. Right. And like like caviar. <laughs> That's what you do. But right. guess how much okay. it costs for you to get? Yeah. Nothing. Right. But if you jack up the price, this is what it is in the art world. 
That's true. I can fucking take my hand, shit in it, throw it on the canvas. I know. And draw a smiley face on it and say America in yellow (laughs) over the top and make it turquoise in the background and say what this means to me right. and say it's fifty thousand dollars and you know what rich right. people will buy that shit right you know what I, that's, that's what true. that's what i learned from and when i went true. up north they said just throw a just a crazy amount on it mm-hmm. and the more ridiculous it is the more likely they'll buy it they said it's a fucking joke right. and, and you know that made me sick i know right so then People who just so they can have it. So then, people who actually sacrifice and actually make but these are people phenomenal that are artwork. On the street, you know? People they use who, mustard right. for yellow. <laughs> but the Come thing on. is, is you take someone who makes phenomenal artwork and they have and they starve to do that and they don't get recognized. I don't give but the, a fuck. But people who <laughs> but that's who that's make what you do. It, shit, I don't give a fuck. get I'm paid. Not even, I'm not crying. Right. No, that's where you would need to be. No, right. stay down there. You don't want to be up there with those fucking shit. I agree. Sons of bitches. I agree. I'm just sending this letter to you. Let you know I love you. I know you still distrust me. Kiss my ass in late July. For what it's good for. Leave your kids at the door. Sincerely. <laughs> David Grant. <laughs> Leave your kids. <laughs> Anthony. I don't know, man. I just write this funny. shit. Don't, don't. Hey, you got something, man. I, I gotta figure out where I'm at. Very funny. Oh, yeah, man. I don't know. I have this song. Random. So, um. <laughs> All right. Do you want to go on to the? You know how I did the. Many people don't know this. Edition. Remember. Do you remember when I used to do that? that many people don't know this, and I bring up four points that many people <laughs> don't yeah. know. Yeah, old school. Yeah. Okay. You want me to bring this yeah. up? Yeah. Okay. Many people don't know this, <laughs> folks. Okay. We'll start with one. Random otters are turning up on shore, donning what could only be described as tiny straight jackets. If the madhouses have opened their doors, why? And why the fuck otters? Many people don't know why this is happening, and many people don't know this. So what do you think is happening with the otters and the straitjackets? They're washing up on shore. What is it? Why otters? What is happening? What's the first thing that comes to mind? <laughs> otters. And straitjackets. They was digging too deep. Oh! Into what? No, butt. No! Get serious, <laughs> what do you think it was? Too deep into what? Into a facility where they oh. was conducting secret experiments. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> oh <laughs> no! Fuck! Wow! Wow! What if you're right? Uh, you know, you know, they said, right. you know, you could be wait, right. I was out here, you know, when I was a kid, you know that. You know my cousin Cole and mm-hmm. Sam? Mm-hmm. I mean, this is how far back we used to go. Uh, because we wondered what. Dude, I lived in the woods. Mm-hmm. It was this creek, and we saw otters, and nobody believed said, There's no otters. There. There's no otters. But no, I was like, <laughs> we watched one. There is now. back, and, yeah. and we chased it. We was trying to beat it over the head with a stick, but we couldn't quite catch it. <laughs> okay. But it was that. You know how you are. Right. I was like, no. We was like, that was a. Yeah, anyway, it doesn't exist. Just right. like they said coyotes and armadillos are around here, but now I'm running over one every other day. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, yeah. warning I'm like, I'm yeah. telling you. And they're aggressive as hell. They're aggressive. They're aggressive. And you always, that's why I say you always got to have a but stick aren't they or so a knife. Cute, so you, can, you know, yeah. you got to be ready to fight. And they're so cute, though. <laughs> Dude, that's how I always say. Right. You got to have a knife. Did, did I tell you I about? Don't give a fuck. Where are you going? Did I tell you about the video before I move on to the yeah. next one? Did I tell you about the video about that um the guy who was on the boat and there was an otter that swam for its fucking life to get to his boat and climbed onto his boat. But you know why he was running? You know why the otter was running? There was an orc trying to eat it. Orca. An orc. An orca trying to eat it. Not an orc, but an orca. This <laughs> one is killer whales. Right? Yeah. Trying to eat it, and the otter leapt onto his boat. Did the did the killer whale eat the boat? 
No. Yeah, those but the otter, like you know, the otter was looking at the guy on the boat and didn't even care. And he said, he, <laughs> he's like, you're the lesser of two evils right now. If you don't mind, <laughs> I'm going to hang out on your boat for a bit. Because that was bad. Like, you're going to get us yeah. both killed. That What'd is scary. I, I remember that. That bo that otter wow, hung out on there. You saw that. Yeah. He got on the man's boat and stayed there. And he was looking at the guy, but he didn't care about him. <laughs> he wow. just said, look at that. That's look cool. at that fucking big bastard out there in the water. And Yeah. And the guy was like, whoa. Because he had an otter on his boat. Wow. <laughs> They're trying. You're right. That's crazy. They're digging too deep. <laughs> They're digging too deep. They're both like. And now we have number two. Because yeah. there's four of these. All right. A bizarre species of alien has made contact with humans recently, but only communicates to those who have tits and whom speak their curious language. It only takes ignorant women as its slaves, but if she's got a pair and she's got the brain cells, she will be spared. There you go. How do you feel about that? What's going on there? Well, to be honest with you. Sure. It's not going to work out. It's not going to work because, out. Because um, they're eliminating um, sex in general. I know. I know and that. And there will be no reproduction. I know. So all of that's going to phase out. Yeah. Nobody's going to have sex anymore. I know. I and know that. they're um, injecting it in you through, I don't know, vaccines. Right. So, I really don't feel nothing about it, but... Right. I, I never cared in the first place. Mm-hmm. I had the same suspicion you had, but people think it's crazy. They still think it's crazy. They still do. That notion. That, that, that sex, sex is going to be... That it's going to be phased out. Do you... I don't know. It's okay. I don't even think it's I okay. Talk about it. But well, I have a whole lot of talk about it. <laughs> how about we just don't? <laughs> but it's okay. But we, if. Okay, so you, you give yeah, me your that, thoughts. I so let's move on. You, know, you did. Well. Thank you. Okay, three. There has been an exceedingly high increase in bicycle related deaths between the years of 2018 to present. Most of us are obviously wondering if this has any correlation with COVID or if an influx in sexting has led to these tragedies. The brains of the dead will be harvested for research, and many people don't know this. <laughs> But they're still sexting. They're not having sex anymore, but they're still sexting. That's funny. I like that because it ties into what you just said. It ties into what you said. So the question is, does... Does the bicycle, the increase in bicycle-related deaths, does it have anything to do with COVID or the influx in sexting? <laughs> what is it? What's making them get in accidents? What's Their happening? lack of, um, finger uh, <laughs> fucking in the asshole. I think it's anal sex <laughs> it's is what's going to save the world. <laughs> I think everybody How is that should at save least get fucked the in world. The house. How is it gonna save the world? Because you would know what it feels like. Well, okay. It's a new experience for those who have never been fucked in the ass. However, and which is okay. And but then the you get one gold ticket to get on a rocket ship and fly to okay. Minnesota. Excuse me, I burped. Okay. So um four. <laughs> Alright, now that's the answer. Okay, four. What the fuck was that? I don't know, but four. What's that cat doing over there? Tobias. What the fuck? He's, we got an orange cat in the house he's with, doing, a, with a sloth with a net? No. Yeah. He's doing cocaine. Where everybody's in. This is the show. Well, okay. I have one more fourth point. Yeah. One more of these. Okay. Four. A teleportation device has been discovered in Maine in the home of an 80-year-old woman. 
She swears she didn't know the damn thing was down there, quote, and blames her deceased husband of 50 years for this media upheaval. It began transmitting strange noises in her basement, and her grandson uncovered it. That bastard. So, what do you think Dad was up to? He's dead, but who do you think? How do you think he got that in his house? The teleportation device. Her husband. How did he get it in there? Because she didn't know anything about he it. He lived a second life, and he actually worked for an intelligence company. And he was slowly still in parts. But nobody knew, because when you work for them, you know, there's people capable of saying, I'm going to the store mm -hmm. and do a mission within 15 minutes, so you not know what they do. She didn't even know. Do you know right. that it's possible saying, I have to go to work today, but actually you took the day off, and you spend the next eight hours flying to one country right. and back. Or one, just across the states and back, just to kill somebody and be back by dinner time. Yes. Do you know how possible that is oh, that nobody yes. ever knows? No one knows. And you were just at the um, butcher shop all day long? Yep, and nobody and ever knows. And not what your name is. That's right. Do you right. know, for the first time, this this is the first job I've had where my identity and right. address is actually true. Right. And when I told him that, I said, what? And I said, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> That's silly. But yeah, do but, you know but, how easy it is to right. be at one place at one time and another and so much time, but you was at the same place right. all the time? Mm -hmm. Because everybody knows your name, but everybody, but if you look like everybody mm -hmm. in the town, they all, they, no yeah, one I suspects you. I saw him. No one yeah. suspects you. Right. It's a nice guy. It's so fucking right. Easy. So never, never take it for granted. That's why you don't trust anyone. That's right. All right. Anyways, that would be a Debbie So that's downer. it. That's it. Now, come on. You got more. I, I do have more. Over there. I do have more. Give me one more, man. But give I'm more. taking up all the time. Give, give me one more. Taking up all the time. Give me one more. Come on. Okay. Yeah, I do have one more. Where's Let the me game? see here. I do have the game. You want to play the game right now? This is called Musical Life. This is new. We didn't really bring up musical um, selections in the past, I don't think. Um, so, you have to pick an instrument that you will play. You have to pick a number between 1 through 4 to get an instrument. Okay. Three. Acoustic guitar. Now... You could have picked one, a trombone, two, a piano, four, a harp. But you got the acoustic guitar. Three. Okay. What it says. It's an instrument ideal for travel in many ways. You admire its romanticism. Nice. You want to know what the other one said? The trombone. If you picked one. You were not entirely confident about this choice of instrument. Okay. Two, piano. This instrument seems to cater to your complex mind. Okay? And four, the harp. This is not everyone's first choice insofar as musical instruments. Perhaps you seek adventure and challenge. So, that was the harp. How many people play the harp? How many people have a harp? <laughs> That's a good question, folks. How many no. people have one? The no, harp. I mean, there's a mouth harp. Right. And a but the string. one that stands upright yeah, on the floor, I, that thing, I that... I don't think I've ever even seen one. Who has yeah, a harp? Really... Right. Okay, so, but if you have one, that's very special. Um, So, what it says, because you picked the acoustic guitar, this is what your results are. This is what happens if you play this guitar. It wasn't easy at first learning to play guitar. Your coordination was off for weeks, but now you're much more comfortable and confident with it. So, do you want to know what your other results would have been if you had chose these other instruments yeah. to learn? What happened? One, the trombone. 
You were more fascinated with watching Katie play the clarinet. You lost interest in the trombone very quickly. That would be if you had picked the trombone. But here's the thing. You also had another result. Do you know what the other result could have been? What? You didn't know if you would take to the trombone, but after many long nights spent practicing, you fell in love with it. You know, some instruments you have to sp you have to practice a long fucking time Man, to master it. it you know, like those wind instruments. Gosh. Well, wind and man. Gee, that, that's... they're tough. They are tough. That's something else. Right. Wind instruments, I always fuck up. Right. Can't do them. I don't even know what my... Can you give me my harmonica over there? I'll, I'll, I'll Your demonstrate. harmonica? Yeah, my harmonica. Yeah, yeah. My, my harmonica. Let me really demonstrate okay. something for you. Wind instruments. One point off. Oh. Chicken wings and macaroni. <laughs> chicken wings and sauerkraut. We eating shrimp on Thursday. <laughs> and chicken wings on Friday night. <laughs> You're silly. Can I tell you something? Can I confess something to you? Yeah. That's pretty good. Here's where I messed up. Here's where That's I messed. That's just what a professional. Okay, we well, here's yeah. where I here's yeah. where I messed up with your guitar. You have to pick a number one or two. Still have to pick a number one or two. 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 So, as much as you wanted to play guitar, you don't have one of your own. And what makes matters worse is your parents think it's a waste of time. Now you must decide whether you should chase your dream of playing guitar or search for another pursuit. So, it's Chase your choice. the dream. Yeah. Every time. All right. That's why I never became anything, and that's why I'm here. But guess where I'm at? Right where I want to fucking be. Mm -hmm. And fuck the world if they don't like it. Right. I'm just existing as I should be. Right. I mean, as... But um, I'm right. just... Fine in my way, but I, in right. my own comfort. As um, I, I don't need money or anything, but I just want to get by. As my parents said, but I that, work uh, for everything I have. They said, when you're an adult, you have to make your own decisions. So that yeah. means you can you but can I, be, you I can play every, guitar. But, but or whatever. I work every day. Right. Every day of the week. Right. I'm just now getting over my back hurting. I couldn't hardly no. stand up straight. We have. But that's good. You want to know your results for the piano? What is it? You had two choices for the piano, too. Maybe it was the instructor, but you grew to hate playing piano after two months. So I can see how an instructor hey. can ruin it, too. Because they can well, be really strict and. Well, right. What I like is just. Leave them alone. I you know. Let them. It. They have to feel it out and and, yeah, and get familiar it, with that. You know? Right. Some instructors will really mess up the whole experience. They will. Oh, they're too strict. Yeah. And two. because when I took guitar lessons, man, at the same time, I, first time, it was the guitar cab, and I was taking guitar lessons, and mm -hmm. I brought a CD, and I wanted to learn Black Sabbath. Right. I brought. Right. I want to fucking, we're going to fucking worship Satan today, you know? <laughs> oh, <laughs> but, but at the same time, I was, they was making me go to these psychiatrists, and they had me on these antidepressants, and like, it fucking had me so dumb in the head, oh, I could I know. That's right. when I realized, fuck all this shit. Right. Would Ozzy Osbourne be taking antidepressants, trying to, because it was so hard, I, I felt like I was slow in the head. I missed that rush of thought. Mm -hmm. So, uh, 
I mean, so that I quit the medication and I went insane, and I can play on uh, Black Sabbath. Yeah, I right. play. I can play uh, Moonlight Sonata and all that. Yeah, guitar. that's cool. That's cool. But I did that on my own. You know how just right. listening to the record and playing it over and over and over and over and over now, and over and over again. It's a, that's a, it's important to make this distinction that a you're right. The piano is also a string instrument. Uh, yeah. String so is, it is. Have, is. But you can tune that, your ear. To that's it. right. It can help you play guitar and vice versa. That's right. Yeah. This is a string piano instrument. Piano guitar go similar. Yeah. Right. I so, like mixing them too. Here was the other choice you could have had for the piano. You find excuses to sneak into your neighbor's house to play piano now. You developed a strong affinity for this instrument. So that was the other choice you could have had if things went well with that instrument. And then, um, is that it? Is it it? Is it it? Is, is it, it now? Or never? Where's the section? I'm, mix I'm missing the section oh, on the harp. Man. You, you just look like Aww. you got Oh, what? I missed the section. I don't know where the section is on the harp. Damn it. I have no idea. Well, we'll never know. Folks will never yeah. know about the harp. Damn. That sucks. You fucked what up. What the hell? Yeah, I did. You fucked I up. did. Well, you fuck up, too. <laughs> we both fuck up, <laughs> You know, I you know, you notice what you did. It's notice? not over. You don't know how bad I fucked up. What do you mean? I was trying not to read this because it's so bad. But since you fucked up, you want to, I was looking at sure. this and I didn't want to read it because I yeah, thought it was so bad. Yeah, I feel like I'm hogging up all the time. So let me fuck up. Okay. This is the news. <laughs> all right. And I looked to the news on my phone because usually I like start writing comedy off the news that's happening. But it's, it was so bad I couldn't. I didn't even want to write nothing about it. So. This is the news. This is, you know, I have the interest points of propaganda. We Great. always have the news. Here it Get is. It. Well, the news is shit's fucked up. Your money isn't real. You're all going to die. Which a fact. Shut the hell up and find a way to not be full of greed. Soon, we will all be eating our own shoes like our great-great-grandparents did. Remember when choking yourself while masturbating was the biggest problem at the time? Around the time you had cereal for breakfast, not but what. Those were the days. That's the news. Do you know where your cubs are? Your cubs. <laughs> this is the news. Thank you. And good night. <laughs> Do you know where your cubs are? I like that. It was really hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's not over with folks, by the way. <clears throat> um. Yeah. That's that's really nice. How about that, man? I wasn't going to read that, but I did. I like Actually, it, it came out pretty good. It did. But it I was did. looking at it, I was like, this is retarded as shit. Right. <laughs> this is what it's, it's like. This right. is stupid. But yeah, it was but pretty But since good. I don't have the section on the harp, okay. what do you think would have turned out with that instrument? Because the only thing it said about it is perhaps you have the thirst for a challenge and adventure because the harp is not the instrument you normally... A will it's not to be weird. A will to be weird, yeah. yeah I now, always like that. A will to be weird. Harps are beautiful. That was though. Oscar Wilde. Right. That's a beautiful instrument. Oh, it really is. Yeah, but you, you, you want wondrous tones. Who would even have a harp? You know, like, a, but, like one yeah, of those. You're going to get beat up a right. couple of times. Right. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> so, you need to pick a set of numbers, but... Here's the thing. These are, you have to pick a set of numbers between 1 through 15. Ooh. Between 1 through 15. Ooh, this is now. now you have to, it okay. says, pick a set of numbers, pick your destination. Okay. It says pick six numbers between 1 through 15. Six numbers between 1 through 15. Two. Okay. Three. 
seven, nine, eight, four, five, two, three. Six. Six. Seven. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Dude, you know what bothers okay, me the most? Okay, here's the thing. What bothers me the most is you're a vegetarian and you're always sober. And you drink water no. and you're the healthiest person in the no, world. No, no, and I'm no, looking no. at you and I'm wondering, <laughs> I want what she's on. Right, but here's the thing. I'm just saying. No, judging by your answers, most of the numbers that you picked were within one section. There's a section. There's three sections that divide up all 15 of these numbers. There's a set. There's three sets is what I'm saying. Okay? Most of the numbers you picked were within the middle set, which is titled earth you had earth heaven and hell so you decided your destination is earth so it doesn't even matter the other numbers you named at the end don't even matter because most of your numbers were within earth okay so there you go birth earth birth so you chose earth do you want to know what that says mister what does it say mister you may, with some luck, have a handsome black father, but possibly a scary white mother. You will have exquisite good looks. Okay. That's what it says. He's got a black daddy? Yeah. You didn't know. Okay. He's got a black okay. daddy he never knowed. <laughs> So, do you want to know what your other destinations could have been? Yes. Hell. You oh, get man. you get one bag of candy, your choice, and one weapon. Could it be skill? And yes, and one weapon which will be given to you. You can't pick you can't pick the weapon. You can only <laughs> You can only pick the candy. And then it says you may lead a resistance donning a colorful shirt. <laughs> That's it. There you go. That's hell. It sounds like hell. Now, okay, honey, you know. <laughs> okay. This is This is okay. Now, heaven. Now, what else? Heaven. You could have picked a heaven. And what happens in heaven? You have all the secrets about earthlings, but it pains you to witness their deplorable behavior, especially towards one another. You perpetually get high to take the edge off. So that's funny. Who would do something like that? In heaven. You're getting high. Who would do that, though? What kind of life would that be? Right, where you have all the secrets of humans. You have yeah, all their secrets. Yeah, but who would, who would, who would want to live that, that life? Who would do that? I don't who know. Who would want to live that life? But you didn't choose that. You, you didn't choose. You picked Earth. You picked Earth. Mm -hmm. You didn't choose to live other people's <laughs> lives. You want to be on this motherfucking They say, you know yeah. what? They got a good cop salad down there. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Oh, I like oh it. Oh my god, okay. Alright. That's what I tell people that want to eat healthy. I'll be like, you know what? You know, you want to pick up lunch from everybody since you're the only one that takes lunch while we don't take lunches. You want to pick everybody up something, drop it over in the back door. I'll be like, yeah, you eating healthy. You want an Italian <laughs> sub? But I said, you know, they got a good chicken salad. And they're like, you eat healthy? And they're like, no, I want an Italian sub. But I'm saying, the chicken salad at Arby's is phenomenal. And it's healthy. And then I mention it to him. And I know like, just give me the pack of the tank, so with the dressing. And I'm like, I thought right. you did. But I'm like, the salad, though, is good, dude. Yeah, it's, give it's me very that. Healthy. It's, give I me eat the salad. salad. If me. I eat, but because I don't eat from, I don't usually go to those establishments. <laughs> but the Arby's 
crispy chicken salad I'll have at least once a week. Give me the salad and shut Otherwise, the fuck up, right? I'm eating out of a can. <laughs> give me the salad. I, yeah, man, give me the fucking salad. Also, it's, it's um... It's very good. It, it I, I, mean, I would also like to, if you don't mind, mister, mm-hmm. would you like to show your um family? You have a picture there. Look at those people. Yeah, look at them. To the left, you have a family. Would you like to show that? Of these guys? Yeah, yeah, can yeah. we show that to them? <laughs> can we show them your family? Yeah. This is your family. Yeah, there you go. This is, um, this is David's family. <laughs> this is family. Okay. And, like, you see where he gets his looks. So <laughs> you see where he gets his... Right, they all have that same look like they're gonna kill you. You know, this is getting weird. That's Gerald. That's not actually... That's, that's, that's Bobby it. Dane to, to right. the left. That's Bobby and, Dane um, and his old... That's not his wife, right. but don't right. tell nobody because that's don't why he got killed. Because right. that's it get... actually not his wife. Right. She found out. Things got ugly. It, it's called adultery. And then yeah. we have. She was wild. And, back you then, know, you know, and she's nice. That's Bessie back there. And he, <laughs> the bitch and had it come. He drank a lot. This is. <laughs> Who would you say that is? Who would you say that is, um. The doctor? Would you say that's the doctor? Um, it's anyway beautiful family. Um, and I just thought the folks might be interested. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, don't whatever. Be- don't believe in okay. what you read. Yeah. Sure. You got angels. Mm-hmm. And GI Joes. <laughs> 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 And the Lord of the Flies. Come here. Come now. (laughs) Don't wait another second. We'll be back next week with another episode of... What's the name? What's the name? (laughs) Items of Interest. Items of Interest. Poems. And propaganda. And to bias. And to bias. Say hello <laughs> to our new friend. Right. We're gonna. Um, so what the fuck is Daniel doing behind him? Do you see that? Daniel! <laughs> you're supposed to be making coffee. <laughs> Where is he? Are you having <laughs> a sexual relationships with that cat? I think he is. Look at <laughs> <laughs> Scary. He better lose protection. He's been around. You know what that smile on his face says? I didn't He's use He's been any. around. I didn't use any. I but didn't but use any. <laughs> you're not the first pussy <laughs> yeah. I've been around. I didn't use any. Yeah. Oh, it's really town, weird. downtown, they call me the alley for a reason. Hey, Sloth! What did you say? What is I it? I saw this dick once, and I liked it. It tasted like peanut butter in a small snow cone. <laughs> For, right. For a dime bag. Okay, alright! I think it's done. We're done! You don't want to play piano? That's what I'm you don't want to be. You think I'm leaving you don't here, want to, but I, I need shades. You don't want to play? I, I can't. What did you just is, do to Tobias? What did you do to him? No. Okay. I had to put on my yeah, fucking sure. shades. You okay. can't mm-hmm. play piano without no yeah. sunglasses. Yeah, on. because you're Ray Charles. Yeah. Gotta do one of that mode. David Grimm.
next week. Bitches. Bitches.